before proceeding, towards adding a printer to the print management server. Make sure that both the PC and the printer are accessible. To verify that both the device, printer and PC are connected to the network and they are communicating with each other. Open command prompt and ping the IP address of the printer from your PC. Click on Start button. Then click on Administrative Tools. And then click on Print Management. Print Management tool will be opened. If we click on the printers on the left side, we can see all the other printers installed on this Print Management server. To add another printer, right click on the Printer tab or right click in the empty space where other printers are installed and then click on Add Printer. After clicking on Add Printer, Adding Printer Wizard will begin, on the first page, choose Add TCP IP option and click on Next button. Type the IP address of the printer. Leave the Auto Detect option checked. Click on Next button. Now Windows will try to communicate with printer and find the drivers, if found. It will ask to install the drivers. Choose the Install the Driver option and then click on Next button. Click on the button which says Have Disk. Click on Browse button. Now go to the folder where we have saved the drivers. Since I have saved on the desktop so I'll go to Desktop and I'll choose the driver for my operating system. I have 64-bit server operating system so first I'll add 64-bit driver. So choose the driver's file and click on Open button. Then click on OK button. We can see all the compatible drivers here. So we will select the one which is for our printer as per the model of our printer. Click on Next button. Here it is asking to type the printer's name. We may type any name. Remember leave the Share this printer option checked. If not, the printer will not be shared and we will not see any shared printer while installing on the client PC. And the shared name of the printer will appear on the client PC with the same name which we type here. Click on Next button. On this page we will see all the details regarding the printer. Click on the Next button. The driver's installation will begin. Wait for the driver to be installed. The driver installation process has been completed. Click on Finish button. 64-bit version of the driver for this printer has been successfully installed. This is our client machine with Windows 7 64-bit installed. We will try to install the shared printer on this machine. Open my computer, type backslash backslash and then IP address of the print server machine. Right click on that printer and click on connect. It will now download and install the driver on the client machine. Finally we need to verify either the printer has been installed successfully on the client PC or not. To verify that, Click on the Start button then click on the devices and printers. On this page, we can see all the shared printers that have been installed including the one that we recently installed on this client machine. If not, then wait for a moment so that the printer configures itself. Sometimes it takes a little time to install and configure the printer's driver. Now I will right click on the printer and just print a test page for the confirmation. As you can see, I have printed the test page successfully. Means we are done here.